Okie dokie. Man, man, bounce around like a pinball. That makes sense to me. Alright. Save my runner. Save the person who's in trouble. And just continue my theme of saving the entirety of this county. You know, like, well, everyone that I can save. Yay, we got plus eight medicine and plus two morale. Good job, Marcus. I'm switching to you after this. This guy's done an amazing job. He's been doing good, but he's finally gotten himself hurt. I could go ahead and just call the doc and, you know, use some more influence, but I think it's time Marcus finally took the reins again. <sighs> kept him, kept everyone alive this long. I can do it a little bit longer. Yeah, I got some blood on her. We should go. I'm almost done. I'll only be a minute. Zombies up ahead. Good job, Ed. Got us in trouble. Dude, help now, please! That wasn't the last of them. Anybody hear me? Oh. Oh, thank God. Let's go. I'm taking you home. I think I'm ready to head home. You better be ready to head home now. Yeah. I got nothing left. Yeah, this guy, he, he's been working hard enough. Let me tell you, there's nothing like staring death in the face to make you reevaluate your life decisions. Like back in college, I was in a car accident. Stupid. Trying to drive home after a frat party. Lost control and swerved off the road. Wrapped my car around a tree. Didn't hurt anybody else, thank God. But three weeks in traction really made me think about the direction I was going. Got out of the hospital, and I swore I was going to clean up my act gets over and turn my life around. And then, the dead started rising from the grave and eating people. Fuck it, I need a drink. Huh. <laughs> that was actually kind of a, I don't know, oddly amusing tale for me. How's it going? I'm almost there. We'll crack open a cold one for you. There you go. Oh, you're not dead. And... Holy shit. Surprises. I'm not dead. There you go. Don't say I never gave you anything. What you got? Oh, you know, stuff. Okay, uh, stash it, stash that, stash everything real quick. At least have him equipped with a pistol, a little bit of ammo. And a machete. Other than that, I'm letting Marcus take over now. Get over to the infirmary, bro. You've, you've done more than enough. Now, what to have Marcus using? Obviously, he needs a blunt weapon. A wooden bat. Hmm, a cricket bat. 
I think I'll take a crowbar. with me. Take some... We're all ready to go. Just waiting on you. Really? Hmm. I'm actually kind of shocked about that. Alright! I guess that's it. I'll do it. Why not? And we kept Marcus alive this whole time. Well, I did. You guys didn't do shit. I'm sorry. That was rude of me. But Marcus is back. He's better than ever. I don't know about better than ever now, but... Let's see how well sh I can aim. <sighs> ah, forget it. Alright, let's do this thing. You know it's not going to be as simple as just all that. It would be cool if there's like a little showing of how well things go for them. Ring a ding ding. Ah, oh, jeez. I may make this a short one just so I can actually show off the end of it properly. Okay. What was I ranting about earlier? Yeah, yeah. Sony's frick. I mean, the PlayStation 4 froze multiple times during the E3 sh showing, like, they were showing it off, it froze during Black Flag, it tried freezing during Watch Dogs, and it froze during Destiny, so I'm just sitting there like, this really what I would like to get? As long as Xbox One doesn't do the retardation that they were planning on, that they're actually supposedly doing, like, I, I have no problem getting one. Hell, I'm actually on there, bow considering Titanfall. Oh, Titanfall. You look so beautiful. You will be mine, and I will pause it right here. So, the fro is back. And oh, birdies. Hi, birdies. 